Hello, beloveds. Welcome to the Amanda Collins podcast. It's my honor to help you awaken to joy, be your greatest self, and live a life you love. I'm Amanda Collins. Each week, I'll share tips, practices, and rituals to help you feel the storehouse of joy inside. I'll answer your questions and talk with thought leaders from around the world about health, wealth, love, conscious living, and parenting. Are you ready to live your most fulfilled life? Welcome to Wisdom Wednesdays. This is episode 32. You are not your past, beloved. You are not your experiences, and you're not what people told you you were. You're not the things that happened to you. None of this defines you. Perhaps you had experiences in your past, some that were out of your control, and some you were just doing the best that you could. Maybe you feel shame or guilt. It's time to let that go. You are not what you perceive as your failures. They were merely experiences. They do not define you. For the first two years of my life, I was unable to walk. I was born with hip dysplasia. And every six weeks, my mom would bring me in and out of hospital to put new casts on. Now I run daily. I take good care of myself. Again, this experience did not define me. When I was a teenager, I went through the rebellion phase. For a period of time, I believed these experiences had a hold over me. And then I had a powerful aha moment that I realized they didn't. I was just a young girl exploring and I could let it go and all the energy that went with it. And I could love and accept myself. You may not always be thinking about the past stories. However, you could possibly be operating from this place. We carry these emotions, vibrations in our physical body, our energy fields. It's all programs that could be running the show. Unless we're willing to let go of the past, it has a power over us and it influences you, perhaps even sabotages you, and will react from a place of hurt and pain. You are not broken. You are perfect just as you are. It's time to let go of the old stories and connect with your true essence, your soul, your spirit, what brings you alive. It's safe to let go of these stories and make space for what you want in your life. Let the past be the past and let's see what magic can happen in the present. A wonderful ritual is to write these stories down, the words, the emotions, write it down on a piece of paper. This can be done on a full moon or any time that feels right. Burn the paper and watch it dissolve into ashes. Put it back in the earth. Offer it to the sea, a river, or to the wind. And as you witness the ashes disappear, affirm to yourself, thank you for the past and all the wisdom and teachings. Today, I declare I am not my past. I forgive. I let go. I am the hero of my own life. Now I'd love to hear from you. How do you not let your stories define you? Please share as your story may be just what someone else needs to have a breakthrough. Thanks, beloveds, for joining us today. Please come over to themandacons.com continue the conversation and get access to all my podcasts, blogs, and videos. Did you enjoy this podcast? 
If so, please subscribe to the Amanda Collins podcast on iTunes and leave us a five-star review. Feel free to pass this podcast on to your friends. That helps us get incredible guests to share their secrets for an inspired and joyful life. If you want more great resources, come over to amandacollins.com and join my mailing list for all my latest content. Thanks so much for listening. Until next time, I'm sending love